This is the one match that I was actually most hoping I would come across. Not because it's especially good against your deck, but just because it, it feels like there's similar strategies. Alright, so there's mine, which is yours. And if you'd like to cut. Ah, okay, so rock, paper, scissors, and there's the paper. Poor little, poor little lonely paper. Alright. And then everything all the way to the top. Alright. Let's do this. <laughs> Time to go. Time to go. Best of luck to you, my friend. Alright. Wait, did he say that the round starts in a minute? Or. I mean, are we allowed to start? No. That's it. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. Let's see. Um. I think I have to keep this hand. This will be this will be interesting to watch. I'll keep it. Okay. Ready? Sit. Round one. Fight. Shock. Let go. <laughs> Just a little one one hex proof. One one hex proof. One one infect. Eh. Okay. Get the shiny, the shiny out. I don't mind doing that now. So we go for. Um, crazy good. Ah uh, yes, you'll have me at fifteen in just a moment. Because life doesn't matter, so <laughs> whatever. <laughs> It, it mattered against uh, Maliripod last week. It did. Yo, I actually got a, a game where I beat Maliripod uh, when he was... He got out Malira, and I'm just like, well, I'm dead, and then somehow managed to make it. He didn't even get out Malira. He just kept killing my infect creatures, so I beat him down with two Hierarchs. Spider Umbra? Okay. Ethereal Armor? Swing four? How much? Uh, four. One, two, three, four. Oh, swing four, four. Yeah, it's a four, four. Oh, yeah, ha, 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 faster. I just heard swing before. I'm slow. <laughs> no, it's all good. Probe. Ooh, okay, so two more spider umbras and a misty rainforest, and I will play reveal. Now that everyone over there knows what I'm playing. <laughs> Sorry. Sure, sure. Mutagenic, 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 mutagenic. Something else. Swing. Okay. Mutagenic. Yes. Big three. You have 12. me at three. That's poison. Sure. Go. All right. How much can you do next turn? Not enough is the answer. Not enough. Oh my god. What is going on? Twelve? Another spider on the <laughs> How did you know? <laughs> that reaction. <laughs> Can't tell if not shuffled enough or shuffled too much. <laughs> I don't know. This would be great for Delver or something. He's like, come on, bro. I got you. So how much is each one? One one? Yeah, each spider armor is a one one, but it also buffs ethereal armor. So beep beep beep. Derp derp derp. <laughs> Let's put the foil one on top. So one, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Because ethereal armor counts itself and all others. Okay. So swing ten. Down to two. Last turn. You gotta kill me this time. Kill me going around. See, this is why I wanted to see this match. Let's, let's race each other as quickly as we can. Not like the hexproof means much in this match. What are you at? You're at three. Yeah, uh, at three in fact, yes. It means you won't side in or uh, dismember, maybe. I don't know. Mm. <laughs> it's like, one moment! <laughs> okay, you play the land. 
when you get home and start using the computer, I'll probably jump over to your computer and do the locks. Sure. Go. Thank you. We have blockers. You have blockers. Text me when you're done, okay? Okay. Swing 10. Okay. Pendlehaven uh, pump. No pump? Okay. Um, main 2. Slippery boggle. Last turn. Oh, and um, let's use this one. So it's uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, it's just 9 now. 9! Hi, Glistener. Go. Okay. My life is too long. Could have killed you last turn. Yeah. All right. Swing nine. Okay. Dim chumps. Uh, put me down to eight. And then I'll play a land. And pass turn. You say you could have killed me last time. Yeah. Oh dear. That's never reassuring. What else? Yes. Drop you to one. Oh my god, he's down to one! It's not a spin down today. You know right where it is. It is a spin down, I should say. It's not a random die. You know right where it is. Half asleep. Which is great for running a deck like this. It kind of just runs itself. A whole, whole lot of thought put into it, I'm afraid. There you go. Okay. Show me what you got. Alright. Yep. Alright. Uh, yep, I see my mistake. I should have left the guy with reach back. Or maybe I shouldn't have attacked. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have attacked. Hmm. Okay. Let's pick it up. My bad. I had a mutagenic that I could have used on, like, what was it, turn three, but I only had two health. So <laughs> that would have killed myself. <laughs> hmm. You got, like, Daybreak Corn at. Rancor. Yes. Rancor would have been brilliant, but. Yeah. Alright, so I'll be on the play. Single play. This is really not. I'm gonna have to do game three if we go to game three. And draw. That's not where I want to be at all. Oh, Jay. Oh, Jay. Do you want to go there? Do you really want to try that? I want to try that. This would be interesting, but I'm not gonna. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, I want to check my deck just to make sure that I actually put it in, but okay, we're, we're fine. We're gonna keep. Oh my god, this could be so silly. <laughs> oh my goodness. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? Six. Alright, six it is then. Back to Phyrexian life. I mean, it, it's, it's fast as they try to do that stuff. Alright, yeah. here we go. Let's see if this is keepable. Yes. Yes. yes, it is. But and we're off. Doubt Are we? Never, you never know. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Are we off? <laughs> yes, we're off. Yep. Dun 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 I kept a creature this hand. That's not good. Yep. Yeah. You know, what is that? Unstable mutation. It's one of the reasons why running blue in this deck makes sense. Yeah, okay. <laughs> if the game goes on long enough, it's often just six extra damage, which is nice and fun. I'll play reveal. Wait a minute. How is it six extra? Well, it's. Plus three, plus three, yeah. and then the next turn it's plus two, plus two, then it's plus one, plus one, and then it goes back to zero, and then it's minus one, minus one, and so on and so forth. Each turn he put, gets a minus one, minus one counter put on that creature. Kind of does the infect for you. 
I yeah. understand how that would be six damage. Though. Oh, because over the first term it's three. It's turn okay. is three extra, yeah. and then it's two. Yeah, yeah, okay. you got it. Now. I was. I thought you were thinking it was plus one counters, and it would go up to six. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah. Well, the, the, uh, I meant to make myself clear. Sorry about that. That that. Uh, yeah. My turn. Fetch. But yeah, yeah, we're, yeah. I swear to God, if I do not put this card in, I'm gonna look so silly. Dry it, Arbor. <laughs> the one one land creature. <laughs> land creature, go! <laughs> they said they're never making any more land creatures. Oh, they're, oh wait, 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 not yet. That was the end of my turn. Well, you just said go. No, 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 no. No, no. So do you want that on, or do you want it? Uh, just, it's, it's fine. You can set it on top. Alright, so now it's my turn. Huh. Okay, I'm going to tap Dried Arbor to put a Rancor on it. Oh, by the way, I'm, I'm taking two, but whatever. I fetched, so I'm at 17, but whatever. It's in fact. And then we'll put a Hyena Umbra on it, just in case you end up destroying it somehow. And, uh, pass turn. Say four two with first strike and trample and totem armor and the land. <laughs> so a boomerang would be really nice <laughs> for you. Bladed agent. Go. All right. Could I be dead? Could I be dead going forward? Fetch and breeding pool. And then take three more. If only an, an aura says that you can block unblockable creatures. That would be nice, wouldn't it? <laughs> There are cards that say that block un creatures become blocked and that this works even if they're unblockable, but that's old tech. Uh, that, I mean, there may be one on the screen if you're showing that. Uh, so anyway, let's see. You could do this a number of ways. How did banding work? Because you could be like, could you band with an unblockable banding creature? Banding didn't work. That's how. <laughs> could you band with an unblockable and have all of them just unblockable? I uh, judge. I mean, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Alright, so Ethereal Armor, Unstable Mutation, alright, so, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Swing, 11, <coughs> Trample, First Strike, yada 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 yada. 7. Alright, pass turn. Can he kill me this turn? Uh oh, that sounds like yes. I've heard this one a long time. Hmm. <laughs> Sounds like I am about to die. Oh yeah. Oh, I cut it. I cut it. Okay. Um, what do I want to do? Win. I can I win? Let's just reveal the hand and see if you got it now. It's good. Actually, you could just for the camera. I mean, because after all, if you don't, I probably got you next turn anyway, so. Maybe. Maybe. Okay, yeah, just in case, let's not do it. Could do the same. How big is that? 
Well, next turn, it will be a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, because that'll have a minus 1, minus 1 on it. 7, 8, 9, 10. It'll be a 10, 10 with trample and first strike and first strike again and, yeah, and totem armor. What's its toughness? Uh, two less than its power, so it will be a toughness because Rancor is only power. Can we maybe dismember it? No, this, no. this might be weird, but I'm just gonna. Okay. Nature's climb ethereal armor? Uh, yes. You gain four life. Woo! Relevancy. There is none. Then I'm gonna say go. Okay. Let's see if you can kill me. Alright. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. I have the six left. Two and three. Oh man, this could go. This could go well, and by well I mean poorly. Um, Spell Sky. I'm gonna play it safe. Kind of. Then I'm gonna swing for six. Yes, swing for six. So swing for lethal. Okay. And minus one, minus one counter. We'll actually we'll put a counter on it for a mutation too, just so that we don't forget. But uh, yeah, that's a uh, past turn. Despite myself, I'm gonna get there. Okay. Despite myself. Let's try this again. Click. All right. My good friend here is gonna be on the play. We're going to see if we can do this today. Come on, new deck. Carry me through this despite my. Come on, let me keep seven. My incompetence as a player. Yeah. I will keep the seven. I will pray. And yeah, let's go. I don't think I can get a better six anyway. Pro. One land. Two creatures. And uh a lot hyena, of, a lot of stuff. Ethereal, Daybreak, and Rancor. I'll play your elf. Yes. Glistener elf. Come on, Glistener. Yes. Because I'm going to race you. You're going to race me? I'm going to race you. That sounds like what we've been doing, yeah. And it makes an appearance. T1 Glistener elf. Wait a second, wait a second. Alright, unofficially, unofficially, I can see. <laughs> Alright, well you know exactly what I'm doing. Did you get new sleeves? Uh, you, yeah, relatively new. They just look really shiny. Oh, good. Goody, goody. Le blocker. Faster. Take three. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm about to adjust the dice. Yeah. It's good to make sure uh, I, don't, I don't forget, because actually in a game that we played, I did forget. So, definitely don't want to do that. I can see that. Strike. Unblockable, plus one, plus out. Okay. Swing two. Yes. You have me at two. Comes back. Get that rebound on. Go. 
Where my land at, though? Oh, boy. This is going to suck. Oh, this is going to suck. My in my deck. Come to my hand. I believe it. I can feel it. I'm doing the same thing. I missed a land as well. All right, so ethereal armor. Yeah. Swing at you for two. Yeah. Thirteen. Best turn. All right. I feel like I have like one, maybe two turns. Race is on. Race is on. Race is on. <laughs> yes. Let's not forget that. And now it'd be into gray. So it's two right now. Mm -hmm. Oh God. John Groth. Yes. Swing for five. You have me at seven. Man, you can go. Okay. We can do this. Maybe. Come on. Ah, oh, don't. Come on, Dad. Okay. Come on, draw gods. Come on, draw gods. Draw gods. Rancor. Pass turn. Playing it safe. Playing it safe. You playing the lands in front of the permanent zone. Well, like <laughs> because I, I'm trying to get used to it, and also I did Dryad Arbor as a creature last time, so. Pendle Oh god. Light agent. Two. My god. Come on, deck. You're a little late, but uh, did you wait? You just got your land too. Yep. Yeah, both of us did. Okay. Um. Four cards in my I think I'm dead if I don't. Yeah, I think I just lose here. That's the idea, Jay. That's the idea. Well, you're at seven. <laughs> yeah, I'm at seven, yeah. And I got one coming through no matter what. And any, literally any pump spell except for Distortion Strike. No, even Distortion Strike, because then you put on the Glistener instead of the Blighted Agent. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. any pump spell. Holy, wait. Dang it! Pendlehaven, too! I'm just screwed in so many ways right now. Where is that stone rain? Where is that stone rain? All right. <laughs> you want to see a, a move that makes absolutely no difference whatsoever? Wait a minute. Oh. Ooh. The plot thickens. What do you get? 13? Mm -hmm. Two unblockable stuff? Is Totem Armor an ability? Uh, yes. It is a static ability. A replacement. Ability. Does it target? Uh, if enchanted creature would be destroyed. But auras target a creature. Yes, yes, they do. So theoretically, you could find when you kill something and the totem armor wouldn't save it because it couldn't be the target of that ability. No, it's it's already targeted. Yeah. yeah. I see what you're on about, though. Yeah. When you're tapped out it's, anyway. It's not like so. a trigger or anything. No. It's a replacement. Dim rules. Dim rules. <sighs> Are you going to kill me or should I kill you? <laughs> uh, that's what I'm working on. I have this funny feeling that I could just really screw this up right now. Let's, hypothetically, let's say I did that. You can, if you can kill me, you should swing. If you can't kill me, then you Four. shouldn't swing. Twelve. Oh, twelve. 
Why must you taunt me? How would you get 12? I don't know what's going on. Uh, if I have a vile... Unless you had... Some of them have tax on them. They all use tax on them. Daybreak Cornet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four. Okay, now, and it's Vigilant, too, so let me, let me see. First Strike, Vigilance, Life Link. Okay, so First Strike, Vigilance, Life Link doesn't matter, but also Trampled, so I'll swing 9 at you. Okay. The Glistener. Anything you want to do to Glistener first? Mutagenic or whatnot? Okay. And then, pass the turn. And then so I die! That's so how much did I take? Oh yeah, you only blocked with one toughness, so you take eight. So five. Prior to that it was one, two, three, six, seven, eight, nine. Yes, you take eight. So I take, I'm down to five. And then I die. And then I die. He's smiling, sort of. I mean, how do you want it? How do I answer that on camera? How do I want it? Let's see, I have five cards in my graveyard. Threshold? No. No, there's no moderate threshold. Well, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna vines so you can't target it with anything. Okay. And then I'm gonna become a mince all the way from Khan to Tarkir. <gasps> For am seven. not worthy, am not <laughs> worthy. <laughs> Um, you know I'm gonna go home and be editing this episode. I'm gonna beat myself up for swinging with that glade cover scout with Reed. Oh, that feels so stupid. Yeah. Oh, in the other game. In the other game, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so the other move, the, what I was debating is I had an ethereal armor in hand, and ethereal armor and hyena umbra is 12, which mm -hmm. still isn't enough. So I put daybreak out so that I could potentially block if I needed to. Yeah, but you didn't to. have land to play those anyways, did you? Uh, I did. They're both white. So I couldn't do the Daybreak and these. Yeah, but you could have done those two and not. Yes, exactly. And it would have gotten close, but not enough. Oh, jeez. Like, I slowed my deck down and up the power levels. <laughs> <laughs> On the one hand, it seems kind of excessive. Become a mess. Like, I put in all the Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Members. I never got a dismember. Uh, my side tech against you was in game one. It was actually, or not game one, in game two, the first time that we sideboarded. I took out all the daybreaks and I sided in, yes, yeah, Spellskite and Kasali and three more Kasalis. So it was a four Kasali. I brought in all the nature's claims. Oh, yes. I believe it. That's why I was worried about Spellskite uh, playing it earlier. Like, I'm, I'm probably in like 10, 11 cards of a sideboard. Jeez. Well, that'll do it then, man. Oh, and here's here's some interesting little tech. Like, you have a Blighted Agent, I have an Invisible Stalker. Oh. <laughs> Alright, man. Took out Mutagenics because they were costing too much. <laughs> yeah. Too much life. Life matters in this so, so, so much. Whew, jeez. Well, so much for going 4 0 today. However, I should very much like for you to go 4 0. I'm gonna go and, and scour the boxes, see if I can find that uh, Unflinching Courage as the card I hadn't pulled out yet, which doesn't make a bit of difference in Oh, well, maybe a little bit. Negligible difference in this match. I'll see you later, everybody. Bye bye.